What's up guys? Kita Q. What's up guys? Um, um, today we doing the drilling of the hubs. I know this video has been long time overdue, but all right. Um, it's here by Ethan. I tried. This is Ethan, guys. I tried um, to drill it on the car. It works, but it takes forever. And Ethan has a um, drill press, so it literally takes like. 20 seconds then it's done but we on what throw size now Ethan? 9.5 we on 9.5 so we must drill it one millimeter big to 10.5 now so we're probably going to drill it to 10 and then to 10.5 and then from there we will tap it but as you guys know um, this is what we used this sorry for the lightning though and stuff but this is what we used and um, this is just to indicate you where to throw exactly and these small holes are just pilot holes so you just throw the pilot holes and after that you just drill it to 10.5 oh you drill it from I think this is 5 more so you drill it from 5 more up until to 10.5 so it's like 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10.5 throw bits so yeah enjoy the process Okay guys, we throw it to 10.5 now and as you can see this is how a hardcore or heavy duty tap look like and um, as you can see it's 12 by 1.5 so 12 more diameter and 1.5 more thread pitch um, I'll show you the difference in a heavy duty one and a not so heavy duty one like this is not so heavy duty you can see you can see, see but you can see there that um, tapping tool is already broken but this is heavy duty we will show you the process on how to do everything so guys uh, this is the tapping process so you turn it and then you like loosen it again um, Lief, what is the purpose when I want to make a fast mark and make a basic way to loose mark? So you make the thread that you have to make it make it very clean. Oh, so you make the thread clean. So you make it now fast and then it's loose. Okay, okay. Perfect. So that is basically, oh actually the last hole guys. This tap is amazing. The other tap I had, I'm not gonna mention the name though of it, but that was. Ooh, I struggled with that tap. But this is. Yo, can't wait, guys. Can't wait. 5x100 PCD. All thanks to this little platzi. All thanks to me. There you go. All tapped, all tapped and ready to be fitted. Um, take note, I did take off like the complete hub because I'm gonna change wheel bearings, everything. I just do it, just do it one time, just to be safe, you know. So yeah, don't wanna be putting on new wheels and then your wheel, or your wheels fall off because of your bearings that's broken. Guys, as you can see. All of them are drilled. There's the new threads in there. 
It's old draw, 5 by 100 PCD. Uh, the normal draw on your car, but it takes forever to draw. So we just decided to put it on a draw press. It's literally super easy on a draw press. So guys, uh, thanks for watching. And um, if you are looking for the metal plate or PCD plate, I'll leave Carlos' um, number or WhatsApp number in the description so that if you guys want to drill it 5 by 100 PCD, then you can take note on the rear um, drums. It's a straightforward business because you don't have to throw in a, in a uh, hub, you just throw in the drum. So, yeah. But you can use it uh, for the front and for the back. But thank you for watching guys and please like and subscribe short.